Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you an easy way to learn the 8 times table. I'll be showing you a very simple math multiplication trick that you can use for the 8 times table. Now let's get right to it. We're going to start off by counting down from 8 to 0. Okay. Now we're going to start off by writing the numbers on top of each other. 8, 7, 6, 5. And with the number 4, you're actually going to write it twice. So 4, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Very simple and straightforward so far. Now to the right of those numbers, we're actually going to be counting upwards by 2. So we're going to skip count by 2's, starting from 0 up to 8. So we're going to start from 0, then 2, because we're counting by 2's, 4, 6, 8, and then back at 0 again, 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. So we counted upwards by 2's, 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, and then once again, 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. Now what we've actually done is we've written down the answers for the 8 times table, the 8 multiplication table, from greatest, from the highest number, to least, to the lowest number. So what we've done is we've actually written down 8 times 1 is 8. 8 times 2 is 16. 8 times 3 is 24. 8 times 4 is 32. 8 times 5 is 40. 8 times 6 is 48. 8 times 7 is 56. 8 times 8 is 64. 8 times 9 is 72. And then 8 times 10 is 80. So we've actually written down the 8 times table, okay? And we, we, we wrote it down with the greatest number, with the highest number at the top and the lowest number at the bottom. Now once again, we just started by writing down, counting down from 8 to 0, but we wrote 4 twice. So 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Then beside those numbers, we counted up by 2's from 0 to 8. 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. And when we did that, we wrote down all of the answers to the 8 times table, to the 8 multiplication table, from 8 times 1 all the way up to 8 times 10. And it's literally that easy. It's that easy to learn the 8 times table. In this video, I've shown you a very simple and easy trick, an easy way to learn the 8 times table. It's a very simple method, easy solution. Follow the instructions in this video and you'll be good to go. I hope that you've enjoyed this math video. Be sure to give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Let me know what you think down below in the comment section and be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.